Hello everybody, yes I am here. Sorry I don't have a cameraman, it's just me, myself and I here in my kitchen. Welcome, got my Purell. We're ready to roll here with a little real estate update. I hope you're doing well, I hope you are safe, I hope you're with your families enjoying togetherness time. Yes, sometimes it's a little too much togetherness as much as we do love our families. Today is Saturday, March 28th. I am Ryan Degnan, Better Homes and Gardens, Rain Realty from the Goshen, New York office, and this is a real estate update. I was gonna do this video on Monday or Tuesday, but the information was rolling out so fast and furious, and I'll be honest with you, in the beginning of the week, it was a bit of a doom and gloom scenario, but I'm happy to say that things are doing much better. In fact, there were actually two closings I know of this week. So I'm gonna run through the process whether you're a buyer, whether you're a seller, I'm gonna give you all the information, I'm gonna bullet point it. This video is about seven or eight minutes long, so you don't have time for me right now. Save me for later when you're, you're over Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok and your eyes are blurry, all right? I'll give you some good information here. Let's dive into it. Essential, am I essential? I feel pretty essential to your life and your real estate endeavors, but New York State has decided that we are not essential during this time of crisis and therefore no, we cannot show houses right now. So if you're a buyer, relax. Nobody's seeing your dream home and scooping it out from underneath you. Nobody can see the houses right now. We cannot show houses. That will come soon, it will end, we will show houses again. So be patient. If there's a house that you're interested in, just call me. I can reach out to the listing agent and say, listen, I've got a buyer, hot to trot. As soon as we can get in, we're gonna come in and see this house. Keep us posted on where you're at with this deal. So, home inspections. Where are we at with home inspections? Okay, so on Monday, it was uh, home inspectors are essential people. Um, I, I got an email from one home inspector, he says, I am putting on gloves and gowns and masks and respirators and goggles. And I was like, wow, maybe you should work in healthcare because uh, you sound like a warrior. Um, and I'm essential and I'm going to do these home inspections. Well, thank you to Jason French from Mount Joy Home Inspection who uh, gave me the factual information. Jason's on his A game, Mount Joy Home Inspections. Uh, he gives me a letter from New York State Association of Home Inspectors. Uh, it's entitled COVID-19, uh, shut it down with three exclamation points. We've just received guidance in writing from Whitney Clark, Deputy, State of, De Deputy Secretary of State for Business Development that home inspections are not an essential service. So no, home inspections are not happening right now. If you're at that point in the pipeline, you gotta just pause for a minute, okay? Appraisals. This information comes from Chris Lavelle, Hudson United Mortgage, one of our affiliate services at Better Homes and Gardens Rand Realty. Uh, appraisals, if you're a conventional buyer, uh, you can do an exterior appraisal, also known as a drive-by appraisal. Uh, if you are a FHA first-time home buyer, no, it's gotta be an interior uh, in, uh, uh, appraisal and you're gonna have to wait a little bit on that. In fact, if you're at that point in the pipeline, uh, you're probably looking at a 90-day mid-June close. Sorry about that, but we have to be patient, we have to be safe. Closings. Closings are still happening. I know of two that happened this week. One thing I do have to fact check is I heard the one closing was held in an attorney's parking lot. If any of my fellow agents know that to be true or not, please uh, instant message me and let me know. The other uh, uh, closing happened in an attorney's office. The listing agent was not there, the buyer's agent was not there, the buyer or the seller were not there. It was just the attorneys and the bank attorneys. I'm sure they took some sort of precaution. Um, as of right now, attorneys are essential and list, uh, closings are happening. That could change at any moment. I'm not as overly concerned about that because they really can be done remotely. As far as the contractual process going back and forth, a lot of times uh, you know, they're being emailed, they're being electronically signed. I know in my company we use a system called .loop and it's pretty much a paperless system. Um, remote notarization is allowed uh, as of right now. Uh, again, remote notarization. So I think, and this may even continue post this crisis, that uh, uh, closings Maybe they won't happen with all of us together. Maybe they, they will do a little more uh, remote closings. Uh, maybe this situation will be a little change agent for that. So closings are happening. They're just happening at a slower rate. Title and municipal searches. So 
Hudson United title, they're working. They're doing a great job at keeping uh, everything going. Uh, just understand they are at the, the mercy of the county clerk's office, which is closed or limited hours, um, and the local municipal services, uh, municipal searches with the towns or the villages. If the village hall or town hall is closed or limited hours, we are at the mercy of them. So title and municipal searches are happening, just probably at a little bit of slower pace, okay? Buyers, should I get pre-approved, Ryan? You can get pre-approved. You can do that remotely over the phone. Um, there's no need for you to meet with anybody in person. It'll take about 30 minutes. Uh, you can fax all your information or email scan it into your lender. And um, your pre-approval is good for 90 to 120 days. So I don't feel an urgency for you to get pre-approved says since you cannot see houses right now. Um, so you maybe you want to take a little time, put a little extra money towards that credit card, get pre-approved for a little more, maybe get a better rate. Uh, also understand it's, it's employment driven. If you're going to be furloughed or you're going to lose your job in the next future, uh, you might want to hold off because they are going to do a final verification of employment prior to close. So just be patient on that. I don't see the need for anybody to run out and get pre-approved. Rate lock-ins. A couple of people, uh, my buyers asked me, Ryan, the lender says I should lock my rate in because of X, Y, Z reasons. We've got to appreciate the market is volatile right now. I am not going to override the advice of your lender, but could you call me and have a discussion with me? Um, I have a very good barometer on when my deals are going to close. So I don't want to see any of my buyers in a situation where uh, they've locked the rate in and we cannot close by the, the expiration date and therefore um, you've got to pay hundreds of dollars to relock your rate. That's stupid. It's unnecessary. So just have a conversation with me. Let's open it up for discussion. Listing appointments. Ryan, I'm thinking about listing in the spring. Will you, can you help me? Of course I can help you. There's no reason I can't come uh, virtually uh, via FaceTime to your house. You can roll me around with the camera. Talk to me as if I was there. I can give you all my staging tips. Let's paint this room. Let's clean the carpets. Let's finish the bathroom. Let's put granite in the kitchen. Oh, and that amazing moose head you have over the master bed. Yeah, that's got to go. Sorry about it. Got to go. We can have these discussions about staging and price point. I can pull the comps. I can give them to you via email. And then before we get ready to list, I can sit with you in person, of course, and actually put eyes on the home and, uh, you know, before we, we finalize that marketing plan. Professional photography, nope, I cannot shoot professional photos right now. Uh, I use professional photography for all my listings, so uh, that's going to be unpaused right now. But there's a lot going on. It's actually a busy time for me. I'm working at home. Realtors are the most creative people, and we're going to get through this. It's not the doom and gloom scenario that everybody thinks. So stick with it. Information is happening, uh, changing rapidly. I'll get it to you as quickly as I can. I'm staying up to date on everything and going to my webinars, and Rand Realty is really great about getting the information out. The important thing is that we all stay safe and healthy, and this too shall pass. Um, I want to make sure I got all my bullet points. I think I hit everything. If there's something I did not answer, email me, text me, call me. If I don't have the answer, I have an amazing amount of professional resources available to me, and I will get you that information. Have a great day, everybody. Be safe. Be healthy.